Hi, I'm Rodney with uh, Cruising with the Chefs, and I'm here in St. Louis this afternoon with Paul and Wendy Hamilton, who own arguably some of the best restaurants in St. Louis. I say arguably because they were just named Restaurateurs of the Year by the Missouri Restaurant Owners Association. So congratulations, guys. Thank, Thank you. you very much. Thank, Thank you. you. We're here, though, to talk about something that's way fun. Uh, can't wait to do it. And we're talking about a Caribbean cruise in January of next year. Yeah, it's, uh, it's very exciting. Wendy and I both used to work, actually, in the cruise business. So for us, this is uh, kind of coming full circle. We left the cruise industry and got into restaurants, and now we get to take the restaurants back on the cruise ship. So we're, we're very excited. You guys actually met on a cruise ship, did you not? We, we did. did. Yeah. yeah, we were both working on a cruise line in uh, 91. 91, yep. And it wasn't the love boat. Wasn't the love boat at that time, no, but it, uh, it worked out to be okay. So It turned out to be a love boat anyway. Exactly. <laughs> well, we're not going on the love boat. We're going on one of the newest ships in the world, the Oceana Riviera, which is a magnificent ship. It's a mid size ship, 1,256 passengers, so it's kind of intimate. But the reason that we chose this ship is... It's, it's all about culinary. It's all about chefs. It's got a Bon Appetit culinary kitchen, which is uh, fantastic. It's lined with TVs, and, uh, and Ivy's going to be doing a demonstration for everyone, along with uh, Wendy and I will be doing one, too. So we're hoping we can live up to his standard. But, uh, but we've done it before, so we're, we're excited about that as well. Yeah, yeah, I was going to say, we're up for the challenge. You know, <laughs> Ivy or, you know, us. We'll see. We'll see. The gauntlet has been dropped. The line has been drawn <laughs> in the sand. Okay. But really, this ship is unbelievable. It has, a, it, it has a, this culinary teaching center, 24 cooking stations. So whatever Ivy's doing or whatever you guys are doing at the front of the room, everybody else is going to be expected to do as well. Yeah, I mean, we won't, be, we won't come up with something that's too difficult, but we'll try to challenge them a little. And we're going to do all this in between these fabulous ports of call. We're fortunate that we have two days at sea that we can do some of this stuff. But then we start hitting Tortola. Antigua, Antigua which is one yep. of our favorite islands. Um, we actually had a, our honeymoon right off of uh, Antigua. Oh, really? Yeah. Then we go to Barbados. Barbados, St. Bart's. Um, we go to... Uh, 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 St. Lucia, um, you know, all these places are places that Wendy and I had been to in the past, and um, they've got some great markets. St. Lucia has a great spice market. Um, you know, we can uh, we can go around and, and look at that too. So, I mean, we're, we we got a lot to do, and it's uh, it's really beautiful time of year to be down there. <laughs> Between the three of us, uh, it it would be scary how many hours, how many days, how many weeks, how many months that we've spent on cruise ships, but. These ports of call, I've never seen an itinerary that did these ports of call in combination. So it's a, it's, a, it's a very unique itinerary. So if you're a frequent cruiser, you've probably never done exactly this. If you like to eat, you're going to love this. If you like the life of luxury, you're going to love this ship. Well, the other part about this is it's uh, French, you know, it's, it's got a French uh, history to it. With Vindicet, obviously being a French restaurant, you go down to the islands here, and they're all French West Indian islands. And so the cuisine comes from, uh, from France, you know, originally as, as it was settled. And um, so we're going to try to, you know, pull some of that into what we're doing on board and also tying it into what we're doing this spring at the restaurant. Anything uh, that uh, everybody needs to look forward to, Wendy, that you can think of? I was say it's. I think it's going to be a culinary delight. Just the ports of call, I'm so excited about, and then the uh, the classroom, limiting it to only 24 passengers, is going to be really exciting. This cruise line is is run by foodies. So if you consider yourself a foodie, if you like to eat, more importantly, you love the art of eating great food, drinking great wine. You know what? We should do a wine tasting. We'll add a wine tasting on while we're doing this as well. But come join us. We only have 40 staterooms, so you need to get everybody kind of in line because this is going to go fast once we release it. So by the time you're seeing this video, people have probably already made reservations. So don't sit around. Call us. It's going to be exciting. Or come down to the restaurant. Ivy um, is here all the time as well as Paul and myself, and we'll chit-chat if you have any questions about any of the itinerary. We hope to see you all on board and warming up in the Caribbean next January.